Hey, welcome to the, another episode of the Bobby Experience. Happy Friday. Uh, so, I want to share this news that I found out about this early this week, two, day, two days ago, that uh, Hugh Jackman is reprising his role as Wolverine for the Marvel Cinematic Universe. He'll be in Deadpool 3. Now, Ryan Reynolds had shared on his Instagram along with Hugh Jackman of his return. Uh, now I have some things that I that I that I'm wondering about here is this how the X one of them is like is this how the X-Men uh, will return? Uh, because I know with uh, with in the multiverse of madness, the uh, that last Doctor Strange movie we saw Professor X, uh, Patrick Stewart's Professor X, get killed off by by Wanda, um, Scarlet Witch, and I thought, oh well, that means that that that's one way the X Men won't make an appearance. So I thought perhaps maybe this uh, this is the way like the X Men may be introduced. Uh, I'm not entirely sure. So it also makes me ask, like, what does this mean for the uh, for the MC the MCU? In the Marvel Cinematic Universe uh, is now another question I have too relating to all of this is um, is this be appearance only going to be once for this one film or are we going to see uh, Hugh Jackman's Wolverine return for, for for other movies in the MCU well it, maybe we're jumping the shark here maybe Hugh Jackman has just agreed to do at least uh, one movie and um, perhaps we'll just take things one step at a time. Um, but what I do know is, is that whenever Hugh Jackman plays Wolverine, he has to get in great shape. And now that he's getting older, I'm looking on uh, online here, according to Wikipedia, he's he's 53 years old. And it the older you get, the, the more challenging it is to maintain that great physique uh, so, I, I think that that'll be a challenge for him like if he if he continues to play uh, Wolverine. Unless like there's a lot of scenes where covering up his torso where he doesn't have to necessarily have like a that kind of show off that physique, having like those those abs and, and whatnot. Uh, there's that too. Uh, but I can simply say that I'm glad that Hugh Jackman's coming back. Uh, because I, I can't picture anyone else being Wolverine. Uh, maybe Tom Hardy, but he's playing Venom. Uh, but that's a bit tricky too, because he made a brief appearance in the MCU when there was a uh, post credit scene in the the Venom sequel, uh, Let There Be Carnage. Uh, and he was in the MCU briefly, and then... It seemed like he left, that he went back. It seemed he might have just went back to the Sony verse. So I don't know what the all the uh, legal ramifications are, what agreements have been made uh, with how Tom Hardy's Venom may or may not appear in the M in the MCU. But that's me going on a little bit of a tangent. So. He, right, so he's the only person that I think off the top of my head that could play uh, Wolverine. Well, I'm excited. I'm glad Hugh Jackman's coming back. I, I thought that both him and Patrick Stewart were uh, retiring their characters. Uh, and apparently, like I said before, Patrick Stewart came back as Professor X. And then next thing we know, uh, it's been confirmed that Hugh Jackman's coming back as Wolverine, so I guess you, you can follow that expression, never say never. Well, this is Bobby with the Bobby Experience. Uh, what are your thoughts on this and uh, your predictions for the MCU? You can leave them down in the comments. All right, take care. Bye-bye.